Alright, welcome back to the world of Assassin's Creed 3. Once again, it has been a while since I played this, which is terrible. So I'm probably going to be messing up all over the place, control-wise. But hey, here's hoping for the best. Why he can't get up on that? There you go. That was supposed to save me a second or two of time, but that backfired. So yeah, we're going to be playing a lot of this over the weekend. Probably go for about two hours today and then just go crazy tomorrow. And uh, we'll see how far we get. At least have a lot to put up, if nothing else. Can we? I think we can swim through that. Ooh, bunny. Was that a bunny? I think it was a bunny. And I did not want you to do that, but... Hope you had fun. <laughs> really? <laughs> He just swan dived in a really wow. Do that again. <laughs> That's amazing. He's like just, he just swan dives into really shallow water, I'm pretty sure. Maybe he's the reason why they have those warnings about no diving in the shallow end of the pool. Maybe maybe he's one of those guys. Come on. Eh, 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 eh. I could kill that. If I could kill it, I wonder what purpose there is. Maybe I could, like, skin it. Get some money for the pelt. Okay, yeah, come on now. There you go. Ah, oh, this is like a long way to go here. Eh, eh. Man, this sucks. I'm still just waiting till we're playing as freaking Connor. I mean, how much time are we going to actually have with the main guy here? It's still, it's still just this guy here. This guy, Sherlock Holmes. Forgot his real name, but eh. Well, I'm sure someone will say it. And remind me. My god, oh, that was a nice little move. That was pretty slick. Look at you being all fancy. Alright, we finally back to town. You swan dive. No? No. It's okay if you have a concussion. You can just walk it off, right? Okay, uh, in here, I guess. Can we go? No, stop it. Just. Yeah, well, we can't even get in through that door. This guy is just really antsy about climbing on top of stuff. <laughs> I don't know why. This is going to be a problem, sir. You and your climbing. Five months later! Alright, now we're making some serious progress. In the cold, cold round. Here, here! Yeah, sure, whatever. T talk to the hand. Hard at work, I see. How did you... <laughs> it is time. <clears throat> We've set up camp to the north. Meet me there. Gentlemen. Let us away. Let us away. I want to remember that, <laughs> honestly. Let us away. I want to remember that. I want to say that in casual conversation at First some point cold. in the near future. Now it's too goddamn hot. Well, he's gonna have to trek through the frickin' snow. Hey. Endless complaining is not All part of us being away. Okay. I said let us away, not to let us complain nonstop. Into that boy one's leave, beef. Bob? What about the bacon? Return to finish out his service under Braddock. I guess I should get his name changed I to Bardock. The bulldog's none too pleased after the stunt we pulled. Pleased to spin a tale of my incompetence and beg forgiveness. He is away with words, especially when it comes to flattery. I expect he'll be welcomed back with open arms. 
You'll be fine. Which would give us a man inside. Precisely. Hey, we await over here. What the heck was that? Uh, why was she walking away? Weren't we supposed to be chit-chatting? Jeez. I see you've been busy. All these men are from many different tribes. United in their desire to see Braddock sent away. Replace with Bardock. The Abenaki, the Lenape, the Shawnee. And you? Who do you stand for? You don't know that yet? Myself. Oh, there you go. What would you have me do? Will you help the others to prepare? Follow. shouldn't ask her what she will have you do. Now you're just going to have an endless hey, list. Come. Everything all right, sir? Just savoring the moment. No doubt, many wonder why it is we've pushed so far west. These are wild lands as yet untamed. And un God damn it, hold on. Didn't I go busy already? What the hell? Apparently not. Unsettled. But it shall not always be so. In time, our holdings will no longer suffice. And that day is closer than you think. We must ensure our people have ample room to grow and further prosper. Which means we need more land. The French understand this and endeavor to prevent such growth. They skirt around our territory, erecting forts and forging alliances, awaiting the day they might strangle us with the new state built. This must not come to pass. We must sever the cord and send them back. This is why we ride. To offer them one last chance. The French will leave. Or they will die. Now is the time to strike. Wait. To scatter the expedition is not enough. I must ensure that Braddock falls. I'll be sure to try again. I'll disguise myself as one of his own and make my way to his side. Your ambush will provide the perfect cover for me to deliver the killing blow. And then we'll slip away. Unknown. We await your signal. Kill militia without triggering there, open conflict. Us. Can I go through? Yep, I can. Yay, nature. The wood's too thick. At this rate, it'll be days before we reach Duquesne. We should follow the river instead. The troop would be exposed there. So that's my target, huh? We are near 2,000 men. One scout is all they need to know of us. And then what? Swiftness would serve us better. So is he gonna like... Yeah, he is. <laughs> that's just freaking wonderful. There you go. Can I manage this from right here? I don't think this is gonna work out. <laughs> oh. Oh, that was optional anyway. Am I locked on or not? I don't. Ugh. Seriously, I won't. I don't think I'll ever get used to this fighting mechanic here. I don't think I'll ever get used to the fighting mechanics in this one. I don't even know what I'm doing. Isn't it beat a counter? Not like I can see anything anyway. I don't know. I'm not a huge fan of the fighting mechanics in this one compared to the other creeds. But maybe if I played this more than once every week or so. Oh, whatever. I don't really care about that optional objective. Well, I don't know. This seems weird. I can't tell if I'm locked on or not. And then, yeah. Muscle memory screws me over so bad. There's a lot of freaking dudes here. Damn. Yeah, uh, don't mind me. I'm just doing whatever. Have served, you mean. Sir, you are grateful to have served. General! Wow. 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 That's all I can say about that. Edward. 
That guy's an asshole. Not so fun on the other end of the barrel, is it? <laughs> Look out! Well. Sir. Oh, hey. Look at that. Good job, soldier. Where are you off to, Edward? So did he get away? Yes, apparently he did. Oh, here we go. Out of my freaking way. Wow, an explosion. Oh, I can shoot him? Do I have to do it right now? I think it was slow motion. I thought it was just a freaking thing. I guess I was supposed to? I don't know why it would have freaking mattered. I was mesmerated by the explosion. Oh, I'm tapping the crap out of Y now. Oh, there you go. I finally managed to shoot once. Reload faster. Uh, no? Okay. Faster horsey. Oh, wow, nice. Well, you're screwed. I never took you for a coward, Edward. Come on, then! No, horsey, why? Such arrogance. I always knew it would be the end of you. Is the end of you. So who are these blue and red guys? Up, oh, good job. Guess they're on the same team too. Hurry before he gets away. This again. Oh damn. Stab him. I said go. 